So, winter's coming. Get your backfire merch. Backfireboards.com To date, Backfire has just launched five new products in one deep breath. In addition to the G2T, which was released at the beginning of this year, a total of six new products are now available. We believe that customers are struggling to decide which kind of board to buy out of the Backfire range. So today, I will run through an explanation in detail of the differences between each product. So, let's get right into it. Sizes. The Mini at 31 inches, that's 79 centimeters. The G2 Black and the G2T, both 37 inches, that's 94 centimeters. Then we have the G3 and the G3 Plus, coming in at 39 inches, that's 99 centimeters. And finally, the Ranger X2 at 43 inches, that's 110 centimeters. Impressive choices. The weights obviously vary dramatically. The Mini, 5.8 kilograms, that's 12.8 pounds. G2 Black, 7 kilograms, that's 15.5 pounds. The G2T, 7.6 kilograms, that's 16.8 pounds. The G3, 8 kilograms, that's 17.6 pounds. And the G3 Plus, at 7.4 kilograms, that's 16.3 pounds. And the Ranger X2, coming in at 10.8 kilograms, that's 23.8 pounds. Obviously, the Mini is the lightest, most convenient, and portable which is one of its most important selling points. The Ranger 2 is the heaviest and largest. If you draw a metaphor with a car, it's an SUV. Let's divide the product range into daily usage scenarios. The Mini is suitable for short distance commuting in the city. It can be taken into the subway, public transportation, or carried in a small bag. You can even fly with it as carry-on. If you often commute in the city, then the compact size combined with an impressive battery life of 15 to 18 kilometers, that's 9 to 11 miles, will perfectly suit you. The G2 Black, G2T, G3 and G3 Plus are all street longboards. As such, they are the most popular choice in the electric board market. They are bigger than the Mini, but they can go much longer distances on one charge. Stability and comfort at higher speeds are a big bonus. They are also more suited to riders who feel a need for speed, all of which have their own different characteristics. Then you can make your decision based on your specific needs. The bonus of buying the G2 Black is its affordability. It's an electric skateboard suitable for the beginners. The G2T is a higher grade version of the G2 Black, targeted at intermediate and experienced riders. Backfire markets the G2 Black not just to make money, but to make friends. We want to build a community of Backfire skaters. Have you subscribed to our channel yet? Backfireboards.com Now I'd like to explain the difference between the G3 and the G3 Plus. The main differences between the G3 and the G3 Plus are as follows. Deck material. The G3 is a hybrid of bamboo and fiberglass, so very flexible, but slightly heavy. The deck of the G3 Plus is constructed from pure carbon fiber. Slightly flexible, but very light. In fact, 600 grams versus 800 grams, or 1.3 versus 1.8 pounds lighter than the G3's deck. Wheels. The G3 comes with 96 mm detachable wheels as standard. The G3 Plus comes with 85 mm detachable wheels, plus included in the package are a set of 96 mm wheels, two entirely different rides. Endurance. The battery capacity of the G3 is 259 watt hours. The G3 Plus is 346 watt hours. As such, the G3 Plus has 1.4 times more range than the G3. However, both the G3 and the G3 Plus use 21,700 model batteries, and the maximum discharge capacity is 60 amps and 70 amps, respectively. So there's no battery overheating or no voltage sag problems. Motor. The G3 uses two 12S 450 watt low powered hub motors. The G3 Plus uses two 12S 600 watt higher powered hub motors, 
so the G3 Plus is better than the G3 for hill climbing and general acceleration. The G3 Plus is Backfire's flagship product. It has a super long battery life of 32 to 40 kilometers, that's 20 to 25 miles. An amazing top speed of 46 kilometers per hour, that's 28.5 miles per hour. The deck is of ultra thin carbon fiber construction, in fact the lightest in its class. Of course, their price is also different. Finally, let me introduce the Ranger X2. It's the second generation all-terrain electric skateboard from Backfire. Top speed coming in at 35 kilometers per hour, that's 22 miles per hour. Range, 26 to 35 kilometers, that's 16 to 22 miles. It has 165 non-inflatable honeycomb wheels and a super flexi deck, which is suited to all kinds of bad road conditions. I can tell you that it's the most comfortable electric skateboard on the market. I personally never feel any discomfort despite the terrain. Combined with Backfire's uniquely designed double kingpin truck, the entire Ranger X2 is very flexible and therefore delivers an incredible deep carving experience. Why do all-terrain boards have to use double kingpin trucks to be truly all-terrain electric skateboards? Because the huge wheel diameter makes it very difficult to complete a tight turn. The unique combination of a flexible deck and a double kingpin trucks solve this problem. For an all-terrain electric skateboard, you can't adapt to all kinds of bad road conditions without big wheels. Without double kingpin trucks, you can't turn tightly, so these two elements are essential. Combined with a huge battery and twin, high-powered hub motors, the Ranger X2 gives you both amazing range and torque. What more could you ask for? Personally, it's my favourite board. So these amazing e-boards are all completely different kinds of animal. Which one is your best choice for you? Order it now on backfireboards.com or be like me and buy more than one. You only live once, right?